Elon Musk has never been afraid of challenges. In a world where many see limits, he sees opportunities and new horizons. From launching SpaceX to leading the electric vehicle revolution with Tesla, Musk has always been at the forefront of innovations that shape the future. Now, he's betting big on a project that is, without a doubt, one of Tesla's most ambitious ventures to date. The humanoid robot, Optimus. And if he's right, the impact of this robot could be as transformative as any of his other creations, with the potential to redefine the concept of work and human-machine interaction. Tesla announced Optimus as part of its innovation portfolio, promising a robot capable of performing domestic and industrial tasks. But Musk sees far beyond the common robotic assistant. He believes Optimus could one day become as relevant as his electric cars and solar batteries. The expectation is that the robot will help Tesla tap into an emerging technology market that, according to Musk, could be worth an impressive $25 trillion in the future. But how did we get here? And what makes the Optimus Gen 3, the third generation of the robot, so special? The path to Optimus Gen 3. To understand what Tesla aims to achieve with Optimus, it's important to look at the project's development so far. When Optimus was first unveiled, it was like many initial projects, a rather rudimentary version. Early prototypes showed a robust robot with visible metal parts and wires, lacking much polish. The second generation, Gen 2, brought significant changes. With a much more integrated and harmonious structure, the robot gained a design closer to that of a human, which is an essential element for Tesla's concept. The Optimus Gen 2 measures approximately 1.78 meters in height and weighs around 68 kg, dimensions that, besides being close to human measurements, were carefully designed to ensure that the robot is agile, stable, and efficient. Its hands have five fingers, capable of complex movements, and it has the ability to turn its neck sideways, helping it interact with the environment more naturally and safely. Although its walking speed is only 1.34 kilometers per h, Tesla claims it will be faster in future versions. The idea is that Optimus will not only be functional, but will have a presence that fits into our daily lives, whether at home or at work. The challenge of creating a more human-like robot. The pursuit of a robot with a human appearance and movements is not just a matter of aesthetics. There are technical and psychological reasons for this choice. From a technical standpoint, a humanoid design offers versatility. It can use tools and interact with objects and environments designed for humans. In practice, this means that Optimus can adapt to factories, homes, and even offices, with little or no adaptation of spaces to accommodate it. This integration capability is one of Tesla's robot's great strengths. From a psychological perspective, the humanoid design facilitates social acceptance of the robot. By looking more like people, Optimus tends to appear less threatening and more friendly which is essential for easing its adoption in environments where human presence is predominant. Musk has always emphasized the importance of creating a machine that people can trust and interact with intuitively. Innovative materials to reduce weight and increase durability. For Optimus Gen 3, Tesla is considering a series of updates to the materials used. Currently, the robot has a balanced structure of metal and plastic but the company has already indicated that it intends to replace some of the metal components with lighter and more durable alternatives, such as carbon fiber or polycarbonate. These materials are widely used in the aerospace and automotive industries due to their strength and lightness. In a robot, these characteristics help reduce weight and increase durability, especially in complex and industrial environments where it may be exposed to heavy machinery and sharp surfaces. The replacement of materials is not just a matter of reducing weight, it has direct implications for the robot's energy efficiency. The lighter Optimus is, the less energy it will need to move and perform its tasks. This means that Tesla will be able to maximize the robot's battery life, increasing its autonomy and potential use in environments where frequent recharging would be impractical. Additionally, lighter materials help make the robot safer, especially in close interaction situations with humans, where reduced weight minimizes the risk of accidents. A face that communicates, the possible screen on its head. One of the most discussed elements for the next generation of Optimus is the possibility of a screen on its face, or rather, on the head of the robot. This screen would not be just a decorative detail. Musk suggested that it could display vital information like Wi-Fi connection status, battery level, and maintenance notifications. But it could also add an emotional aspect to the robot, 
This touch is part of Musk's vision to make technology accessible and friendly, as opposed to the cold and impersonal aesthetic that often characterizes machines. Beyond status information, the screen could play an important role in visual communication with humans. An expression of emotions, even if simplified, would help reinforce Optimus's friendly character and ease its acceptance in familiar environments. The use of colored LEDs to indicate the robot's state, such as green for ready and red for alert, has already been mentioned as a possibility. This would make interacting with the robot more intuitive, especially for people who are not accustomed to advanced technology. The most revolutionary advancement, verbal communication with Optimus. Beyond the screen, another innovative aspect generating great anticipation is Optimus's ability to communicate verbally. According to Musk, the Optimus Gen 3 will be able to speak using an advanced language system. Imagine a robot that not only understands commands, but can respond contextually, similar to what we are accustomed to with virtual assistants like Siri or Google Assistant but with an even more sophisticated touch. Tesla intends to integrate language models with artificial intelligence into Optimus, which will enable the robot to answer questions, tell stories, and even make recommendations. This takes Optimus to a new level. It's not just a robot programmed to follow basic commands, but an intelligent device that can interact, learn, and adapt to the needs of its users. In the future, we could see Optimus accompanying people in their daily activities, answering complex questions, and even assisting with caregiving and support tasks. This includes, for example, helping elderly or disabled individuals perform household chores, providing not only practical help but also companionship that responds and interacts naturally. Flexibility and Precision – The Evolution of Optimus's Hands Optimus's hand has been redesigned several times to ensure greater flexibility and precision. Currently, it has 11 degrees of freedom in each hand allowing it to perform delicate and complex movements, such as holding an egg or manipulating small parts on assembly lines. This level of precision is essential for the robot to perform tasks that require care and dexterity, like tightening screws, organizing objects, and even packing fragile items. With the advancement to Gen 3, Tesla aims to further increase the hand's movement capability, making them more sensitive and responsive to touch. Tesla is already developing more precise touch sensors, which will allow the robot to measure applied pressure and adjust its force automatically. This is an important differentiator, as one of the great limitations of robots in the past was the lack of refined control in handling delicate objects. If Optimus can perform tasks with the same dexterity as a human, it will open up a range of possibilities for automation in industries that have, until now, relied exclusively on human manual skills. The future of manufacturing and the expansion of the robotic workforce Beyond improvements in design and functionality, Optimus represents a fundamental shift in how we conceive of robots' roles in the workplace. Historically, robots were designed to perform specific and repetitive tasks in factories, but Optimus has been designed with a broader, more adaptable approach, with its ability to understand verbal commands, its mobility, and its skilled hands. It can be introduced into a much wider range of sectors, from factories to offices and even homes where task types vary from simple to complex, and needs can change constantly. Elon Musk's vision for Optimus goes far beyond simple automation of repetitive tasks on production lines. He envisions a world where the robot can be used to perform any physical work that is dangerous, tedious, or even emotionally exhausting for humans. Think, for example, of tasks like cleaning large factories or warehouses, where the environment can be uncomfortable and even risky or in construction, where conditions are not always safe. With Optimus, there is the possibility of replacing human labor in these activities, protecting people from risks, and allowing them to focus on more creative and less exhausting functions. Robots as caregivers and personal assistants. Beyond factories and industrial settings, Optimus Gen 3 has the potential to play a significant role in personal care, especially for those who need support with daily activities. Imagine a scenario where an elderly person living alone could rely on Optimus to help them move around the house, fetch items, or even monitor basic health, sending alerts to family members in case of emergency. For people with reduced mobility, Optimus could assist with simple tasks like opening doors, carrying items, and even reminding them of medication schedules. 
This possibility of home care support represents a significant promise, especially for the United States, where the population is aging rapidly and the demand for caregivers grows year after year. For families and individuals who struggle to access quality human care or need additional support, Optimus could be a viable solution, providing reliable, fatigue-free assistance with a constant and friendly presence. Of course, there is a long way to go before people are fully comfortable with robots in their homes, but the idea of a machine that combines functionality with a friendly appearance and communicative interaction could ease this transition. The humanization of technology and ethical challenges. While Tesla works to make Optimus more efficient and integrated into the human environment, questions also arise about the ethical and social impacts of this technology. With the advancement of humanoid robots in the market, one concern is how work relationships and social interactions will be affected. Will people be willing to accept robots in their daily routines, whether at work or home? And more importantly, how can this constant functional presence influence our concept of companionship, connection, and support? Elon Musk has been an advocate for the responsible use of artificial intelligence, but using robots like Optimus for caregiving or even in personal assistant roles raises questions about boundaries and privacy. To what extent do we trust a machine to care for our loved ones or share space with us? Although these robots can be highly functional, it's essential to ensure that their use is always safe and that interactions respect the privacy and dignity of the people involved. These debates about ethics and technology are crucial, as the introduction of Optimus and similar robots could redefine our interaction with technology and even our concept of community. Optimus in the market, what to expect in the coming years. Tesla has already indicated that after the completion of Optimus Gen 3 development, scaling up production of this robot will be one of its priorities. Musk's idea is for Optimus to first be used in Tesla's own factories and facilities before being widely distributed to other companies and consumers. This way, Tesla can monitor and refine the robot's functionalities in a controlled environment, making adjustments and improvements as needed. This strategy allows Tesla to identify and resolve any issues before the robot is made available to the general market, which is a prudent approach, especially considering the complexity of a humanoid robot. If the launch of Optimus in the market happens as planned, it could become one of the first machines to reach a level of mass production, which would be a milestone for commercial robotics. For the end consumer, this would mean that in just a few years, Optimus could be accessible not only to large corporations, but also to small businesses and even families. This leads us to envision a future where the use of robots for domestic and caregiving tasks becomes commonplace, making Optimus a part of daily life for many people. The evolution of artificial intelligence in Optimus. While the design and mechanical functionality of Optimus are vital to its performance, the robot's true revolution lies in its artificial intelligence. Tesla intends to equip Optimus with machine learning and voice recognition capabilities that allow it to evolve and adapt to each user's needs. Unlike many traditional industrial robots, which operate according to predefined commands, Optimus will have flexibility similar to voice assistants like Siri or Alexa, but with a much greater level of sophistication and personalization. The possibility of Optimus learning from experience means it can become more efficient and intuitive over time. In a domestic setting, for example, the robot could learn specific user preferences, such as furniture arrangement, the timing of certain tasks, and even each person's tone of voice. At work, it could adapt to the pace of production and even anticipate needs, adjusting its actions according to environmental demands. This integration of advanced AI, however, brings with it challenges of security and privacy. For Optimus to be useful, it needs to collect data from its environment and from the individuals it interacts with. Tesla has the responsibility to ensure that this data is protected and that AI usage is transparent and respects users' rights. Musk has always emphasized that AI should be handled with caution and regulation, and this certainly applies to Optimus, as consumer trust will be crucial for the robot's widespread adoption. The transformative potential of Optimus in society. The introduction of Optimus could mark the beginning of a new era, where humanoid robots play an active role in our daily lives. It's not an exaggeration to think that in a few decades, a robot like Optimus could be as common as a smartphone or laptop. This future would bring not only a shift in how we work and care for our loved ones, 
but also a new social dynamic, where machines collaborate with us in ways previously unimaginable. For the labor market, this represents both opportunities and challenges. On one hand, optimists could fill gaps in sectors facing labor shortages, such as construction, elderly care, and domestic services. On the other hand, its introduction in sectors with high demand for unskilled labor raises questions about job replacement and the economic impact on communities that rely on these jobs. However, as with other technological revolutions, advanced robotics and artificial intelligence also have the potential to create new opportunities. The arrival of Optimus and other advanced robots will drive demand for technology, engineering, and maintenance professionals. Additionally, new service markets, such as personalization and robot training, may emerge to serve the growing user base of these automated assistants. A look to the future. As Tesla advances with Optimus and explores its potential, we are witnessing a transformation that combines the power of artificial intelligence with the versatility of a humanoid machine. Elon Musk and his team have a clear vision, a society where robots like Optimus are an integral part of our routine, assisting in everything from simple tasks to complex and specialized functions. In the coming years, we will see how Optimus develops and adapts to the expectations of a society that is moving increasingly toward automation and coexistence with intelligent machines. Tesla's robot is more than a technological curiosity. It is a key piece in a puzzle that will shape the future of the next generations. And who knows? Perhaps in a not-so-distant future, many of us will have an Optimus at home, performing tasks, offering support, and even becoming part of our daily lives in a way that only science fiction dared to imagine. So what do you think of this revolution? Does the possibility of having a robot like Optimus in daily life excite you? Leave your comment and share your opinions. And if you want to follow every step of this journey toward the future of robotics, don't forget to like and follow the channel to stay updated on the latest news.